welcome to battery bug electronics workshop today we will see how to use a breadboard first of all what is a breadboard a breadboard as you can see here it's a plastic board with many holes now you can use these holes to construct your electronics project now some of these holes are linked we will see the holes which are linked and which are not linked as you can see here there are four rows of horizontal holes this is the first row this is the second row so we have two horizontal rows on top and when you come to the bottom of the board you can see another two rows of holes now these horizontal holes are linked like as i have shown here via a red color line the holes these holes are connected up to here so how many holes are there 1 2 3 4 5 again 5 again 5 so 5 phis are these 25 holes are connected together here you can see horizontal holes are connected similarly the bottom holes are connected i have used a black line to show the holes which are connected now there is a gap here and this gap is not connected that's why it is written not connected but you can connect while building a circuit using a hook up wire that we will see later how we can connect these two holes these horizontal holes are generally used for connecting the battery or the power or i can say that you can power your breadboard using these horizontal holes you can connect a battery positive to the uh red color line and battery negative to the ne black color line so as i told you the horizontal holes are generally used for connecting a battery or for powering your breadboard now there are vertical holes these vertical holes are connected together like for example come to this point 1 2 3 4 5 these five holes are connected i have shown this connection using green line vertical holes are connected like that you can see here all the vertical holes are connected now in a breadboard there is a gap here and this gap is generally used for connecting your ic that i will show you later how you can connect an ic to a breadboard now the breadboard comes in different sizes this is a bigger breadboard similarly you have a smaller breadboard so you can use any one depending upon uh, your project now come to here here i have a picture wherein i have connected a battery to the horizontal holes so this red wire red wire generally indicates positive of the battery and black wire indicates the negative of the battery so the red wire comes here now the top row rows here the top row is now made plus and the second row is made minus similarly i have shown how you can connect a resistor or any other component to a breadboard and then as i told you in the previous picture there is a gap here and you can connect an ic so how we can connect this is how you can hook up your ic to the breadboard now in the next video i'll show you practically how you can build a circuit using this breadboard thank you for watching battery bug electronic workshop